This is Bernie Keeser with the Crooked Star Ranch. Uh, I promised you a video, so I'm going to kind of stand here. I'm going to kind of walk up this way just a little, little bit. And I'm going to start from here. I don't want them to scatter much. All right, the one on the far right that you're seeing, that's the elder statesman of this group. She is, that's Liza Jane. She's going to be, oh, in that 11, 12, 12-year-old 12 range, okay? And I will show you her calves. I'll talk about her more as we go along. There's Mr. Barron. Barron is the steer that's not going anywhere. He's the guy that's just going to stay here. All right, this right here is a breeding cow. She has yet to calf this year, okay? We've got this girl right here. She's a little small red thing, one number 127. Uh, she is actually out of one of my better cows. I really like, I really like her, okay? Here we go down to, I'm gonna kinda ease down this way and I'm probably gonna start walking and they're gonna start walking. All right, we got 134 here. Again, she's, she's calved this year. Um, I sold her calf, again, a great cow. Uh, this girl right here, the gray one that just kinda walked by, I'm gonna walk around this way. Um, come on, come on. As I'm, as I'm walking, you're gonna see some white blaze, two white blaze face cows. There they are right there. Those two right there are full sisters and they are out of Eliza Jane. All right, this girl here, that's Sophia. She is a master grand champion. Um, she's again gonna be about a nine, nine year old cow, calves every year, does just, just fine. Um, she is, she, again, you just can't, even at her age, you can't pick her apart much. Uh, back here, let's, I'm gonna kind of zoom in. Now, where did you go? I've got two red ones there. This girl right here, sun's kind of getting my screen. I can't really see what I'm looking at. The girl right there in the middle, she is a great cow. Um, just as docile as she can be. She's not halter broke, but she's certainly about as easy to handle as, as she can be until she puts a calf on the ground. She puts a calf on the ground, buddy, you better, wa wa you better watch out because she is flat gonna, gonna bring it to you. This girl, and you can see these three are almost identical, uh, those three, along with this one right back here. You can see there's probably not an ounce of difference between between them. Now, this girl here, I've got a gray cow up front that is out of that same line. Uh, that would be Adeline. Again, you can kind of see, I, I'm kind of sitting here, not most of them aren't paying me any attention. Now, this girl here, she's just gonna be one of those animals that's always standing over, standing over there. This is about as close as we're actually gonna get to her. Um, probably honestly one of the prettiest cows I've ever seen. I, I dehorned her for safety reasons, um, but again, you, she's fine in a pasture. You, you get her closed up in a pen, and at that point in time, you're probably gonna have some problems. Um, but she's otherwise a beautiful animal. Matter of fact, I'm bottle feeding her calf just because I didn't, I didn't want her to imprint her, her uh, lack of social skills on her. Now this little girl right here, I'm gonna zoom in here just a little bit. She's actually a 2014 cow, an absolute tiny little thing. Just a tiny little calf. And again, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kind of walk through here and show you some of the other calves. That white blaze calf there, that's a hep heifer, belongs to this cow right here. All right. Uh, that paint, that red and white, lighter red and white paint, where's the, where is, Lucky Charm. There she is. You can see the white and you can see the white place, I mean the white paint on her. I'll scoop back just a little bit. Okay, and I'm gonna kind of walk back this direction. Okay, all of these here you're seeing here, all four of these here, the two big gray ones back there, and that red red one. And again, I got another gray one out front. And we'll scan this direction too. You can see the gray one right there. All those animals have calved. The little red one there has not. I haven't put her with the bull yet. Okay. Now I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you some 2015 calf. There's a 2016 little bull calf right there. That's one of them. Okay. Kind of walk through here. 
Number 117, that, lack, that red one right there, she's a hep heifer. This little guy's one of the 2015 bull calves, okay, along with this little tiny guy right here. Um, those two, all three of these calves right there, you can see the paint uh, and the two red ones right there, they're both heifers. Anyway, that's kind of what I got, and you can kind of see, I'm just kind of standing out here amongst them. I'm not stirring them up much. That is a Dexter Zebu Cross. She will stay unless you just want her. She will stay. Uh, again, the little heifer. Oh, that white blaze face one right there is a heifer. And like I said, she belongs to one of the other white blazes. But that's all out of that Liza Jane um, chili. I have had a bull by him a five-star chili. He's a master grand champion bull. So all, all of these girls are, are out of him. Um, and actually, all these guys are are open and if you wanted me to go back or do something with him i could probably get him on property too um, but most of these guys are open because i haven't put them back with the with the bull yet um hey girl come here come here come here i know there you go beautiful right there she's just a great looking little calf this this one is to really like her head i'm gonna pan around here let you see her. That's out of Lucky Charm. Look how bright and loud she is. And again, this is Liza Jane. She's, she's just an old girl that's out, out, out here. You can see her memory system is just not any good at all. And honestly, her calves are worth, she's worth keeping, and her calves are worth bottle feeding. Um, just a great anim, animal. I mean, she's, she's big, but this is what she produces. That's what she produces right there. Um, Oh, where's the other one? That gray one right there. Turn around, Britt. Come here, girl. Turn around. Turn around. That gray one right there has that white blaze face on it, too. And again, it's funny is they get in the wintertime and they'll get just as white as they can be and they'll actually lose that, that white blaze face. Um, but in the wintertime, it, it all comes back. So Anyway, you can see off in the distance there, some of the low lines, a little baldy face one back there. Again, this is Mr. Barron. He's just going to hang out with us. 214-796-0877. That's 214-796-0877. And I'm going to step back here so you can kind of see the entire group. Less one. Like I say, I've got a gray cow up front. Um, she, just, she just got up in the front pasture. But she's probably about the most docile one of the bunch. So, uh, again, one, two, three, four, five grays the rest are reds uh, i guess six gray uh, all adults the rest are reds and oh i do have a gray i do i take that back i have that gray cow right there i have her heifer calf that we're bottle feeding so anyway that's it give me a shout 214-796-0877 bye